our next video is going to uh, kind of introduce us to Cortana. Um, Cortana is a uh, search uh, box that Windows 10 has added in its one of its most recent releases. Um, and I thought I'd give it a little bit of a shot. Cortana has a place in my heart. I played Halo for many years and she was the AI in Halo and uh, was very helpful but kind of turned dark at the end. Anyway, that's a different story. If, uh, if you want to learn more about the origins of Cortana, then um, I suggest you play a lot of Halo. Okay, so let's get started. <clears throat> uh, I will make sure and put the link uh, from uh, the Microsoft support page that, that we're working from at the top of the description of this video. So uh, we start off here, need a hand with Windows 10. Type a keyword or question in the search box on the taskbar and you'll find help from Microsoft and Cortana. So let's, uh, let's, uh, let's try this out a little bit. Um, I've actually uh, been using this quite a bit. Um, to me it's easier than having to dig around in Windows 10 to find certain things like control panel or uh, my network. <laughs> my network wireless network adapter seems to be having problems every time there's a roll-up release for Windows 10. So what we'll do is we'll just follow what they do here and uh, we'll try to find it fast. So if you don't know where to find a setting or a feature you want, there's a good chance a single word will get you there. So for example, type sleep. So let's go down. Here's your um, Cortana search, ask me anything. And so let's type in sleep. And what they're wanting us to do is look up the um, PC uh, sleep settings. So let's click on that and see what it pulls up. Okay, so you can see I have everything turned to never because I like my computer running at all times. So um, let's go to the next one. All right, let's uh, type uninstall. And I've actually done this before for un uninstalling my daughter's games that seem to get piled up on here. So um, normally you can click on programs and features um, and then uh, to uninstall or change a program you just simply right click on it uh, the one that you want to get rid of and just select uninstall um, and it's simple as that and to me that is a heck of a lot faster than having to go through and search uh, from the Windows Start button and hitting the control panel from Windows settings and then uh, getting you know, removing your apps from here. There's a lot of clicks to get to that spot from here, and um, it's easier just to type in um, uninstall. Uh, one that I use all the time is uh, I just type in network, and I like to view my network connections, and you can see I am connected here, and you can right click and get the properties for your network adapter really quickly. Um, you can diagnose the connection, you can do a lot of stuff from here. Um, so this part, uh, I've actually grown to like this uh, search box quite a bit. I'm sorry, quite a bit. <laughs> okay, so um, next is the quick answers section. So let's, let's kind of trick things up. Um, it's easy to type stuff in there, but let's, let's see if Cortana understands what I'm talking about. So. Um, let's click the little microphone and since I have a headset and a mic hooked up to it as I am talking to you, um, let me click on it and see what pops up. Okay, so you can see Cortana is banging stuff out here um, and it actually looks pretty good, uh, better than I expected. So let me just hit search here and see what Cortana does. Well, if she doesn't know, she just pops it into Bing. Okay, so let's try the suggestion they, um, yeah, there's Master Chief, okay, talked about Halo 5. Okay, let's get rid of this. Let me try this again, and I'll be quiet for a second. And what it'll say is something like, um, uh, something like groceries. So let me um, click on this. Groceries. I'd be happy to help out with that. As soon as you sign in, I can get started. Okay, let's sign in. Um, there's nothing on your grocery list. Okay, so um, let's do this. Okay, let's add ice cream 
to my grocery list. Let me try that again. Ice cream to my grocery list. Okay. Okay, so it's dumped me out on the um, Bing uh, search engine. And I don't know, that's pretty accurate. Ice cream to my groceries list. Um, I This looks like it's going to take some work for me. Let me uh, do something else. Um, uh, how do I adopt a cat? Okay, that's pretty good. That was pretty fast. Um, it actually uh, uh, did a, an accurate transcription and got it into Bing. Huh. Okay, this is this is nice. Uh, it's more whimsical than anything else. Since I'm sitting at the computer, I can probably type it just as fast as I can say it for the most part. Um, <clears throat> So if you want to play around with the mic with Cortana, I do know she, uh, she takes a little time to get used to your personality and they of course want you to sign in to your Microsoft account uh, to, fo to follow everything that you're doing to give you a better experience of course. Everything's un under the guise of giving you a better experience. Um, sure, why not? So let's uh, scroll down to the little note down here since we're at the end of this section Cortana is only available in certain countries and regions and some Cortana features may not be available everywhere if Cortana isn't available you can still use search well of course you can I hope you enjoyed the video thank you